Welcome to the glamorous world of real estate. And one thing I do want to mention, the two most important words in new home construction are plum and level. It's important that you have the right tools when you're looking at a home for a client. Hey, why is your level so much bigger than my level? I found more important than you are. <laughs> so this house is being framed and it's getting ready to be sheetrocked. You can see the sheetrock just came in. So they're buttoning up everything in the inside of the house. So it's real important to check before the sheetrock goes up to make sure nothing has been missed and everything is where it's supposed to be. This is our roadmap for building this house. One of the things that are really important that we need to discuss today is a floor joist versus a ceiling floor joist. The floor joist system is reinforced and is normally has the supports 12 inches apart. The ceiling joists are 16 inches apart, but when you have that four inches less, that gives you extra support so that you could go into your attic lay down plywood and be able to store things and let it support. In construction, you're going to have the outer sheathing get knocked loose or holes put in it, especially when they drill through it to put the wiring in. So this type of installation you're going to see that's, that's taking care of that issue. So you know, in the last couple of winters here in Texas, we've had crazy cold winters. And a lot of homes, lines water lines burst. Well, most of our builders today are using PEX and they've done away with the copper. If it does freeze, it will expand and it does not break and then it goes back to its normal size once it unfreezes. So it saves thousands of dollars for homeowners. Now we're finished. We've completed showing you this house in the pre-sheetrock stage and... Now we're going to go look at one that has been sheetrocked. I love the fact that most of the builders, or a lot of the builders, are now putting the media room downstairs. Well, people actually use them when they're downstairs. Yes. Because when they're upstairs, a lot of people didn't want to go upstairs in the evening to watch a movie. Downstairs, it becomes part of the whole family. Take a quick look at the kitchen. Oh, my oh look at that island, Marion. That's that great. That is awesome. And the cabinet's going all the way to the ceiling. That's a nice touch, giving a real finished look. Yes. So this cutout is for a gas cooktop, which is awesome. We all love to cook on gas in Texas. Oh, I love these big doors. This just makes this area part of the home. You can just extend your living out here. Uh, you know, when guests are over, it just all feels like one big party space. Well, they're expensive. They are. But they certainly are worth it. They're beautiful. They're amazing. It's beautiful up here. It's great high ceilings. I love the cutouts, the way this looks. It makes the room, the room's huge, but it really makes it look big. Today we're going to finish our tour of construction with a house that's just almost ready to move into. Marion, when does this one close? In about six weeks. Six weeks, so we are very, very close to the end. Um, and so this one's really starting to take shape. It's beautiful. So this isn't just a hobby for us. Marion has actually written a book. What's the name of your book? On the Level, New Home Construction Nailed Down. I also have been authorized by the Texas Real Estate Commission to teach construction classes. So I teach everything from the ground up on how to build a house. We would love to help you and we look forward to taking care of you. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye, guys.